Would you like to learn an easy way of connecting and controlling an RGB LED strip? Stay tuned! Hello and welcome to Poseidon Tech. I'm Theo and in this episode we will see an easy way of controlling an RGB LED strip using our mobile phone. This is W Lightbox, the smallest wireless light controller in the world. It is from Blackbox Company. Let's unbox it. This small LED controller allows you to control RGB white LED strip or one RGB and one white LED strip or four single color LED strips. Let's see now some specs. Voltage 12 to 24 volts, maximum current 12 amps, 3 amps per channel and communication via Wi-Fi 2.4 GHz. Here you can see the different connections. One is for RGB white LED strip, two is for one RGB LED strip and one white LED strip, and three is for four single color LED strips. In this episode we will make the connections for one RGB LED strip and one white LED strip. First, connect the 24 volts that are needed from the LED strips in order to work. Connect the 24 volts positive wire to the plus connector. the 24 volts negative wire to the minus connector. The RGB LED strip wires are White is positive wire G is the green wire R is the red wire and B is the blue wire. So, connect the red wire to our connector. green wire to G connector, blue wire to B connector. Connect white wire of RGB LED strip with the red positive wire of the white LED strip. And the black negative wire of the white LED strip to W connector. That's it! Connect the DC power supply to an AC power plug and we are ready. Take now your mobile phone and download WBOX application. Go to your Wi-Fi settings and connect to Wi-Fi with name W Lightbox and your device serial number. Open WBOX app and choose Devices. Under Direct Device, you will find your W Lightbox. Press the Add button. Your device is added to the application. Press on the device. Go to Settings by pressing the gear icon on the upper right corner. For general settings, change the name of the device, for example Demo Room RGB. Make sure that Remote Access is enabled. From Color Mode, choose RGB White, since we want to control one RGB LED strip and one white. Connect the device to your Wi-Fi. Choose your SSID and press Connect. Give your Wi-Fi password and press again Connect. OK, W Lightbox is connected to our Wi-Fi. I will leave the access point mode enabled for backup.
make sure to set the correct time zone. At last, by pressing Get New Firmware, you can upgrade WLite with the latest firmware. Now let's connect back to our Wi-Fi and try to control the LED strips. You can switch on and off RGB and white LED strip. You can change the colors. You can dim up and down your lights. You can create custom colors. You can select a predefined color from the palette. You can create an effect very easy. You can customize it by setting your desired duration. Now let's set also a timer. Go to settings and schedule. Choose days of the week. From time you can choose time of a day, minutes before sunrise, minutes after sunrise, minutes before sunset and minutes after sunset. Let's choose time of a day. Choose color for the RGB LED strip and if you want to enable also the white LED strip. Give a time and save it. Turn off the lights in order to test it. As you can see, it works fine. At last, let's test the remote access. Turn off your Wi-Fi and enable mobile data. As you can see, the application works without the need of port forwarding. Of course, you can access your W Lightbox from a web browser and control your lights and access all the settings by just writing its IP address. That was W Lightbox, the smallest wireless light controller in the world. If you like my videos, consider subscribing to my channel. You will help me continue with more tutorials like this one. It will be great to read your thoughts to the comment section. Thanks for watching.